G'day fishos, I'm just about to head out for a live baiting session. I've just opened a new aerator. I've got a couple sitting there, but I've always got a couple of new ones in the packet. They're only 15 bucks from Kmart, so been using them for years. They do the job nicely. Um, I was going to say, oh yeah, what happens here, it's got a switch that kind of sticks out a little bit. And just for peace of mind, like I like to keep the battery in there. Um, you know, there's your low speed, there's your high speed. But just a tip I've been doing over the years, um, I thought I'll show you guys. Open the packet up, chuck your battery in, and then on the front of the packet, oh, that's a black, I don't know, what is it? Half mil plastic, some, something like that. Nice clear plastic. What I do, I just cut a um, piece like that. Let's focus. I suppose it's about uh, an inch by an inch. I shape it to an L. And it's about, uh, what's that, uh, 15 mil wide, something like that. So what I, what I do there, I jam it down just to stop the connection. So it's a bit hard to do it one-handed. All right, there you go, she's in there. And that's just to prevent um, the circuit, you know. So if that switch gets bumped... You're not going to get to your trip and find out that you've flattened your battery anyways and so we'll make connection again good to go and what i do with this so you don't lose it i jam it down just on the side of the battery there so you can just see it and then you put the cover on so you don't lose it all right quick tip of the day thanks for watching happy fishing